Hey guys, it's Biosphere here. And I know it's a little bit late, but I'm going to be talking about the compendium, uh, the fall season compendium for 2015. So basically I bought this thing on level 25 and I'm up to level 26 now. The reason why you wanna buy this compendium, um, especially at the level 25, is so that you get um, you get sets and you get chests and you get a whole lot of stuff and also when you reach uh, level 30 um, you get something cool as well but i'll get into that okay so obviously it talks about the venue it's at frankfurt uh, it's a three million dollar prize pool and it's the main events from november 16th to november 21st these are your compendium challenges it's very similar to tr5 now what they've introduced which is new which is really cool is the coin wa wagering so let me just explain this quickly what happens when you start a game um, if you've got say 100 coins or 200 coins or 300 coins you can wager 100 coins then if you've got 500 coins and above you can you, if you've got that many then you can wager 500 coins and i think there's also a thousand coin one Oh, there we go. It says a thousand coins. Okay, so you can either wager a hundred, five hundred, or a thousand. So you can't do like three hundred. You can only do one hundred. You can't do three hundreds. You know what I mean? So that that's a little bit lame, but um, I suppose it just restricts people going overboard and wagering like ten thousand coins on a game, because that would be overboard. Like, imagine you win the game. Imagine you lose the game. You lose ten thousand coins go and cry yourself to sleep anyhow um yeah and then what you win back is five percent less i think minus five the wages from all the players are added together minus five percent so say you've got um, your friend and you wager 100 each then you minus five percent from that so i think you only get 90 you only win 90 so if your friend wages 100 coins and you wager 100 and you win the game, you'll get 90. You'll get your 100 back and you'll get an extra 90. So that's kind of how it works. It's a really, really cool thing, I think. Uh, but there's only one problem is that, and I've done it myself, when you are wagering coins, like 500 coins, you generally play with people that you know and you play heroes that you know you're going to win with so and you basically try hard like crazy it's like playing ranked so it's a little bit crappy there because if you just want to have a game and have some fun and then these guys pull in and they they're like a four stack and they've like playing every single hero that they love playing and they're so good at and they just wreck your face so you either like wreck or you get wrecked so that's kind of like what it's done but it's a really cool way to earn coins i mean you can play like four games actually not even you could you can do like one challenge that gets you say 300 coins or 600 coins then you get the 600 coins you wager 500 that's pretty cool okay anyways let's let's move on so when you're redeeming redeeming your coins you can either redeem them for an item a random item a treasure at 400 coins i'll talk about that now or redeem for a set so it's like tr5's compendium but except for the chest part so this chest is this whole thing over here it's this coin treasure chest and basically what this chest does is i'm sure you've seen videos on youtube if you are looking for videos about this thing where um you have bronze tier items which are these three silver tier items which are these three and then gold tier items which are sets except for this one this is just that cape but it's gold so when i initially bought this compendium i thought oh, okay you could randomly get one of these things but after opening i think three or four after opening four chests i've only ever got bronze tier but if you've got three bronze tier you can um what is it called i don't know when you combine them um so you can combine them to get a silver tier and if you've got three silver tiers you can combine them to get a gold tier so that's kind of what i'm aiming at i want to get the timber saw set 
It is so sick. Uh, yeah, so that's kind of what I'm aiming at. But I have redeemed two or three sets so far and one chest. Um, in my last few games, I've been trying to do the 10 hero challenge. Okay, so anyways, that's that whole story. Now you get your 10 hero challenge, which you can do two of. Um, so far I've done Void, Spirit Breaker, Viper, and Earthshaker. Yay! And then obviously when you complete that, you get 150 compendium points for each completion. Wow, that's so lame. That is so lame. I, don't even, I think I'm actually going to stop doing that. That's like hardly anything. They should have made it like a thousand. That's silly. Okay, anyways. So I've been doing that because my compendium challenges are still on cooldown. And then obviously you can buy levels like every compendium. Okay, so here are the level rewards. At the moment, I'm gonna, or I'm looking to become, to get to level 30 because then I get tribute of the piercing beak. I'm not quite sure what that is, but I want it. Uh, as you can see, a lot of these are locked. So you'll get them at a later stage once they finish doing them. But this level 25 gets you all of this stuff. So you get tribute of the piercing beak. Hmm. Uh, full season 2015 coin charm so that's uh, oh you get the prediction charms okay so i got two of those and if you predict correctly for three in a row then you get a, a coin treasure chest which is the one for these items and then obviously if you predict tw uh, twice wrong then it becomes a fragment or something and it also gives you 200% uh, challenge coin rate, which I was really keen for. So when you get coins from other players and you get coins in game or whatever, then it's 200%. So you get more. It's awesome. Uh, teleportation effect one. It's like like a green effect. It's not as noticeable as the TR5 one, but you'll find in game you'll see the green and you'll be like, hang on, is that you know the hero that's green um like the color green on the map and sometimes it gets a bit confusing so i don't know i don't know too much about that one i don't like it that much but whatever you get it uh fall season 2015 career which is that little chicken looking thing i can show it to you if you really want to see it but uh yeah i'm not going to show it in this video there's so many videos on youtube that you can go watch fall season 2015 mr icons Look, it's not the same as the TR5 Compendium, but it is still pretty cool. Um, and it, it gives a motivation to play and you can actually achieve a lot more by playing and whatever, whatever. Um, then you get all of these Compendium achievements. So like complete one Compendium challenge. Like so easy. Um, win 1,500 coins by wagering. Um, win... 15,000 coins by wagering. I definitely want to do that. That'll be so cool. Uh, complete 10 compendium challenges. So yeah, you can never read through these. Um, you can just pause the video and read them. Click this icon to be taken to the item recycler. No, thank you. Uh, okay, so the tribute collection. Now, when you buy the compendium, you get the oh that's what it is tribute of the piercing beak okay never mind i was being an idiot so that's this chest and when you open it you get any one of these sets and you can get this thing this bag which you can apply to one of the sets to make it um have like an arcana look to it uh i can show you quickly let me just show you quickly the lena one the lena one is amazing yeah, so this is the Lena one. It's pretty, pretty amazing. Um, so what I did was I applied, uh, if you can have a look here, that's without the effect. And then I applied that bag thing and she has an effect. Um, I also did it to Spectre um, on its, or her weapon, its weapon. So this weapon here, um, so you can see if you take it off it's just plain so that's pretty cool and he's also got one for his head 
yeah so a lot of people have been getting this tusker one which is quite cool um i definitely want to get the ursa one i love ursa so yeah i'm really keen to get that one like i might even be tempted to swap the lena one for the ursa one maybe if it's got like effects on it as well because i don't play lena enough and i play ursa a lot so anyways um and then this is tribute of the sharpened feather which is going to be another treasure chest or whatever like kind of like tr5's compendium they had three different immortals sets of immortals yeah so that's that's it that is the compendium um i hope you liked this video uh, if you did go and click like yes now go click it yeah it would really help and if you have any questions or any suggestions or whatever you can put them in the comment section um otherwise thanks for watching cheers guys